this video, we're going to be talking about the cheapest violin cases that you can buy on the internet. Stick around to the end of the video. You don't want to miss this. Hi there, my name is Eric. I'm a violinist dedicated to helping you become a better violinist. If you're new to the channel, I do a lot of violin tips, violin tutorials, and product reviews and videos such as this one. If you haven't done so already, please make sure to hit the subscribe button hit the bell notifications, that way you get notified for when new videos come out. It also helps out the channel to provide more videos for you because these videos are not sponsored. I'm gonna be using fiddlershop.com to help explore the cheapest violin cases that you can buy. Let's dive in. Cool, so we are on fiddlershop.com and we are gonna go to the cases category. And in the violin cases, you have different options for violin cases. You have the oblong cases, the shaped violin cases. Typically with oblong cases, you can fit more inside the cases because they probably have like a bigger pouch for you to store your accessories and whatnot. So I have an oblong case, but I'm actually thinking about transitioning into a shaped case just because it's um, a little cleaner and um, I don't need as much material inside the, the oblong case as I used to back when I was in college. Let's go ahead and click on the violin cases here and you have a different variety of cases, but we are going to explore the five cheapest cases today. We are going to sort this by price low to high to see what are what is available, and we are gonna switch over to violin cases so that way we only see violin cases. Cool, so something that's a little bit of a, a like very blurry is that you see a bunch of like bow cases and some of these are actually not like violin cases per se. They're like case covers. So we are just gonna talk about the violin cases in this video. So let's have a look here. The top five cheapest violin cases on Fiddler Shop. We have the Endeavor violin case for $59.99. And it looks like this is only for a quarter size. And that's the thing with these prices is that they're so low that sometimes they get out of stock. So you wanna make sure that if you have like a notification for the website for when they get restocks in these cases, you wanna make sure you sign up for those. So we have 59.99 Endeavor Violin case. Let's take a look at what's inside. Looks like there's a nice gray pouch here and it uh, comes with a little blanket, some strings, some extra strings and uh, looks like it has a plastic handle with the locking mechanism. Really cool, great, let's go ahead and go to the next page. We have the, the core shaped wood shell violin case. This is for $88, has more variety in terms of the, uh, the sizes that are available. And I remember when I used to work at a violin rental shop that this used to be a very popular case for uh, rental students, uh, just because they are very durable, they're cheap, and they also are um, providing a lot of space. Although it's not like the other one where you have like a pouch. This area over here, you can put like your shoulder rest, actually, um, sorry, um, you could put your shoulder rest in here. Um, if you have a couple different bows, you can still fit those in and are in a basic rosin in this pouch here. And that looks like the price on this seems to be $88 and you might find other cheap violin cases like on Amazon, but Fiddler Shop is a, is a renowned uh, violin shop and instrument shop, and they don't go around just buying whatever and selling whatever. So even though they're at a very cheap price, you can be assured that these are actually decent cases, like if you're a beginner violinist. Let's continue on. This also has a locking mechanism. Let's go to the next one. Um, this is a case cover, so we're not going to include that. This is also a case cover. Uh, the Gaywa Bio S shaped violin case. So this is the third on the list because this is first, this is the second, and this is the third. Let's check out the Gaywa uh, Bio S shape. Looks like they are completely out of stock, but uh, still under a hundred dollars, ninety-three dollars and twenty cents. Um, let's take a look at what's inside. Looks like it has a nice plush material. And what's cool, um, what I'm noticing already is that you have like this little pouch for where uh, the where the top of the shoulder the violin meets the neck that's a pretty sensitive area for violinists I'd be very curious to know like how how much cushion there is right over here and looks like you can, can you can 
put two bows inside the violin case. I'm guessing that it's very light. Um, looks like um, this actually looks like looks like it's from like recycled material. But let's see. Uh, violin case is a full size violin case. Organic flax shell. It's a medium torsional strength. Lightweight has good insulation properties and offers medium puncture impact protection. Yeah, so that's where the the puncture impact protection comes in. We have uh, this little pouch here, and this little pouch over here that kind of keeps the violin secure. So that's that's pretty cool. That's pretty neat. And again, it's pretty lightweight. I'm guessing with this material, it's going to be very light. But again, it's not um, as safe as like you would compare it to like a more expensive violin case, like a like a BAM from France or anything like that. Um, has an accessory compartment, uh, patented swivel type holder for two bows, yada, yada, yada. Um, this goes for 9320. Looks like this is a very popular case because it's unavailable. Um, people are buying this. So, so far we have the Endeavor, the core shape wood shell violin case, the Geo Bio S, that's number three on our list. Let's go to the bow block. Yeah, bow block, I love bow block cases. And this is cool, this is fun because it comes in different colors. I really, really like this. And my guess is that this is a full size violin case. You have pink, green, tan, red, gray, sky blue, gray. You have all these really cool different colors. I think the orange one really pops out. I really like that one. Um, Bow Block is an American company. And um, I remember that these are, these are like built like tanks these cases so even though you're going on the on the pricier side nearing the hundred dollar mark you know you will have this case for a long time my experience with the case is that it's very heavy so if you're on the go if you're traveling um, or you just leave the violin at home and you need something secure this is a good case if you are traveling and if you're on the subway this might really hurt your shoulders and it re really might hurt your back a little bit or if you're in it for the workout and you really don't go to the gym, well, I guess then you can go with this. Um, but no, these cases are built like tanks and they're really, really great. Um, full suspension, neck tie down, blanket over here. It comes with a blanket. Let's see if we zoom in. Yeah, it has a suspension case right over here. And I, I believe these have a wood shell. Let me double check. Yeah, plywood shell that helps cover um, the violin and protects the violin in case of any damage. Um, so that's that's a great plus. And what's cool is that, I mean, the, the strap, it's a Velcro strap. I'm not a fan of that. I would much rather have it like a, a nice softer texture on the strap. Um, but I think they're pretty much invested on the protection of the, of the shell uh, for the violin case. And uh, they probably invested a little bit more into that. And you also have a pocket. And that's really nice. You have a pocket for all your accessories like the bow, rosin, uh, rosin, excuse me. What's also pretty neat is that you have this pouch. So if you are like starting to load up on your accessories as a violinist, you cannot fit like more than just a rosin in that tiny case inside the case. Um, you, you can always go to the exterior. It looks like it's weather uh, water resistant. Um, and let's see if it is water resistant. It says offers ultimate protection, fits, fits most carry-on dimension restriction for air travel, instrument blanket included. Yeah, so even though this is like catering towards travelers, um, it's still a heavy case. So if you're like on the subway in the city, this probably might not be for you. So last but not least, we have the bow block wooden suspension shaped violin case. So you're wondering what is why is this different than the previous bow block? Well, the difference is is that they added a suspension system right over here, which elevates the violin ever so slightly, so that way if the violin drops on the ground, then you know the the violin is not going to get damaged from the top or the bottom of the instrument. So that's a really cool feature, and looks like this is just ten bucks more. And I don't see why not you can't just get this one. Uh, it's a pretty fancy looking case. Um, it has like more professional look. Uh, it has a black exterior and you have more professional colors like the red, the, oh, I guess it's RGB, uh, red, blue, and green. So that's kind of nice. Um, also, this is uh, has a pouch, it has a good grip. I remember having these, vi these violin handles have a good grip. Again, these bow block cases are built like tanks. So if you buy this case, you have it for a very long time. And it looks like, what is this here? Uh, available colors of velour. Yeah, that's on the interior. 
let's see what else is inside. So green, gray, blue, tan. OK, they won't provide pictures. But they have the velour. Uh, by the way, um, if you're interested, the texture inside the case is very soft. Um, as it's, it's as if you're like petting a kitten. It's as soft as that. So, but, however, it is very heavy. It's a six pound case. And it doesn't include straps, which is kind of a bummer. You have to use that as an add-on. You have to a la carte. Um, includes instrument blanket, which is great, but still six pounds. I mean, that's pretty heavy for a violin case. Again, if like if you're in a car driving and you're just like going from A to B with a car, that's fine. But if you're on the subway, that's something to consider as you're purchasing uh, a violin case um, that is this heavy. In general, you know, the more expensive you go, you'll notice that the violin cases get a lot lighter because you pay for the technology of the case being light and protective. I hope this video uh, provided a lot of value for you. If you like these violin cases, I'm going to provide links in the bottom in the violin uh, YouTube channel description right over here. And uh, yeah, let me know what your thoughts. What is your favorite case out of all the five cases? I'd love to get a conversation going with you. Until next time, I'll see you in the next video.